everyone, day four. I just woke up and it was raining outside. I decided to wait a little bit until it stops raining. And I don't know, it looks like it stops raining. So, you know, I will have a breakfast, I will organize everything, and I will go. The night was. The night was good. Mm, I feel, I feel pretty good. But tired. I had uh, troubles to sleep at night. I don't know. Maybe the first time in, you know, on the Vancouver Island and whatever. Hmm. I don't know really what to say. I have to eat something. You know, I'm just. <sighs> I need to do like 16 kilometers to the city, Duncan. Then I have 28 to Ladysmith and 23 to Nanaimo, and uh, I'll be in Vancouver pretty much. So I hope everything goes well because I'm waiting for a sun just to dry everything. Because for the last two days it was raining. So I'm next to the very famous bridge, like I don't know. Castle, Trestle Bridge or whatever mm. and you know of yesterday I found just a place to sleep if, like next to this next to the intersection like there are two roads I'm really tired but I go okay see you bye so day number four I arrived to a very nice place. I'm walking on a Cowichan Valley Trail and just take a look. This is a very famous bridge in Canada. It's called Kinsol Trestle Bridge. It's like it's a historic site. So basically let's let's take a walk. Hello everyone. This is day number five no four or five. I don't remember. Today I found a very nice people and I was hiking, you know, in the rain, everything. Basically I did like 20 kilometers, maybe 16, 20, something like that. After a night in a tent, it's raining, like it's been raining for three days now. I'm really tired, everything hurts me, but it's not a big deal, I can just do some stretches. I was walking on the street, I found a sign that there is a, there is a store and I decided that it might be a good idea to go to the store and it, it was like, <laughs> oh my god, the best thing ever you can imagine like soft drinks like Coca-Cola, Fanta, mm, all this stuff but basically I needed some sugar mm, it was a good idea at that moment I had some cookies some cake and the woman that was serving me um, basically oh one moment what she did she had a lot of different connections like in a city because it's a small community I don't think it's more than 10,000 people so it looks like a like a small village nothing more than this and uh, somehow I was invited to a farm it's a people with disabilities or something and uh, volunteers and some family who is basically like a, I don't know I don't know how to call it but it's like a farm that there is a lot of people here so it was nice we had a great dinner steak fries a salad I met a, I was talking with older lady that was Polish it's amazing to speak Polish, you know, after a long day. At the moment, as you can see, oh my god, I'm in a in a small cottage, like a, you know, basically just a few meters square. But I have everything I need. I have like a small kitchen. I have a fire, just in case my bed is upstairs, and there. Outside, maybe you can see. No, you don't see. 
it's raining oh my god all the time so you know I'm really happy because this cabin it's really oh sorry for the light it's amazing I'm gonna sit I have my computer here because we have a power and uh, yes so tomorrow my plans I am heading to to Ladysmith which is I don't know something like I have five kilometers it might be like 30 kilometers so just in case you know um, it's a beginning of my walk across Canada I just want to you know step by step um, practice I need to adapt my body to a very big effort so yes I will try to do it in one day like a very long day like 30 kilometers and in Ladysmith you know maybe I will find someone so like a cabin or someone will just you know invite me um, then from Ladysmith it would be like the last stretch 23 kilometers to Nanaimo it's like a small community but there is a ferry to Vancouver and uh, Mr. Zenon is waiting for me in Vancouver and uh, you know I hope you enjoy mm, I don't know what to say I'm really tired it's 9.25 p.m. local time and you know that was my day 4 of my walk across Canada sorry for not posting any videos on my website and everywhere but you know it's um, it's really something big it takes a lot of time to prepare all these movies so you know a small delay it's not a problem sometimes I'm in the forest I can record my movies but uh, for example in this cabin I don't have internet so you know it's very hard to update you with uh, with all this stuff and then I think in Vancouver I will spend like four days I will update I will update my website I will rest I will Mm, supply myself with you know mountain equipment with the equipment for winter like uh, you know I'll just miss a few things for Rocky Mountains and you know day by day, day by day slowly and I will make at some point I'll be making like 40 kilometers a day but you know just to begin just in case you need some music to do